Hello! Welcome to a new video. Another one where I buy unrated slimes. Unrated meaning zero views, zero ratings. Usually what I do is I go on Amazon, search for slime, go on filters, sort the results by the newest arrivals, and up comes a lot of them. And I just buy a couple and see what's up with them, if they're good, bad, etc. It's a risk because we depend on reviews when we buy things online. And if there's none of that, we don't know what to expect. That's kind of, that's, that's low-key scary. First up is this clear plant themed slime. This is called a slime kit for kids, seaweed underwater, world glow, and target transparent slime putty stretchy kids toy number two. That's what this is called. Here are the listing pictures for this one. Very pretty and apparently this glows in the dark as well. The little pebbles in the slime. There were also a few options of different variations of the plant themes that you can choose from. Prices do vary as well, just a couple of cents off. The one that I picked cost $7.05. This pretty much looks exactly like the listing pictures, which is nice and I'm really happy about. The texture is weird because it doesn't feel overactivated and stiff, but when I try to stretch it, it rips. Not sure what's up with that, but this is very clear. It comes with the same accessories as you see in the listing pictures. Unfortunately, the pebbles do not glow in the dark and surprisingly, the seaweed does not hurt when I poke the slime. It doesn't smell like anything. I do want to point out that the pebbles do fall out sometimes and it just gets annoying so I had to take that all out. It also has a slight jiggly bounce to it. Overall, the slime is not bad. Presentation is there. Next one is a slime toy 60 slash 100 milliliter DIY fruit lemon chips mud clay plastic stress relief kids toy kit 100 milliliters and these are the <laughs> These are the listing pictures for this one as different fruit slices and all of that. It looks like a, a really buttery, fluffy slime. So this one was actually really cheap. This one was $3.92. Uh, however, there was a shipping fee of $1.50, I believe. So around five bucks for this one. As soon as I opened it, I saw that the top looked pretty much identical to the listing photo, but as soon as I touched this, I was just not expecting it to be so stiff. I could not even poke it at all. It was just straight up clay. Was not fun getting it out of the container at all. Had a bit of trouble with that, so I couldn't get everything out. This was just not a good slime. I wouldn't even call it slime. It's just straight up clay. When I stretch it, it does remind me of putty, the way it stretches and how it becomes stringy like that. It looks like a buttery, fluffy slime in the pictures, but it just does not feel like that at all. Like I said before, it doesn't even feel like slime. And when I try to poke this, my finger just sit on top. I have to manually push my fingers into it so it's not pokeable. I also don't like the smell but it's very mild. You can't smell it unless you put it in front of your face. It reminds me of tires or some kind of smell in a car shop. Only things I like about this is the bright neon color and how it came with all of the fruit accessories.
Coming right up is a slime kit for kids, 60 slash 120 milliliters, fruit ice cream slime, mod click craft stress relief, sludge kids toy, cherry hashtag 120 milliliters. So this is a fruit themed slime. I see a kiwi, grape, pineapple, cherry, strawberry. You can choose any of them. You have different options. You can choose any of the different fruits. I chose cherry and that is $5.58. Upon opening this, I was surprised because the foam balls actually had a fuzzy texture, but they were also a lot smaller than I expected. In the photos, they look a lot bigger and take up more space. Texture-wise, it reminds me of the previous slime, the yellow neon slime with the fruit slices, except it's way softer and more slime-like. It was a little annoying getting the slime out of the container because the diameter or width, I don't know, is not big enough. It also reminds me of a marshmallow, the way it looks and kinda how it feels. Not really because it's not the softest slime that I ever felt. The scent is subtle. It smells like chlorine. You can't really poke the slime, but it is great for squishing and stretching and for playing with one hand as well. Next up is the slime kit for kids, 120 milliliters, fruit cookies, ice cream, mixing cloud cotton slime, puff plasticine kids toy number one. I was really sold on the packaging of this and I was curious to see if I would actually get what I see in the pictures. There are also different options you can choose from, different color themes. The one that I picked was $7.17. It was packaged quite securely, it had its own styrofoam box. I was pleasantly surprised when I got this because it looks exactly like the pictures. It also wasn't mixed during shipping. I was just, I was just impressed. So everything from the packaging to the presentation is on point, but texture wise, not on point unfortunately. It reminded me of the yellow neon slime. Just feels like straight up clay. Well, the white part felt like that and then the pink and blue was softer but it was still quite stiff. I had to use more strength to stretch this, especially mixing up all the colors. It was not smooth. It becomes a really pretty lavender color. The smell is very similar to the yellow neon one. It's very mild and it smells like tires. <laughs> Last but not least, this is a watermelon butter slime, scented DIY butter slime, toys, party favors for kids, stress relief, 7 ounces. This is a vibrant pink butter slime that comes with sprinkles and a watermelon charm. It's $8.99. It came in its own mailer, separate from the other slimes, and it was also in a... I just blanked out on what those are called bubble wrap bubble wrap baggy so I was concerned because when I opened it I saw two different shades of pink the darker pink was really sticky and liquidy so I had to activate it I had to activate the whole thing once it's activated it's good again this one is a hundred percent the most slime like and it is slime but 
out of all of the slimes in this video. Sprinkles and Charm was in a baggie, but it was in the slime. Surprise! Here I am in the slime! Texture is amazing. It's super stretchy and smooth and buttery. However, not a fan of the scent. It smells like baby lotion. I wasn't sure exactly what it is. It just reminds me of baby lotion. It was also quite strong as well. That concludes this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!